This is the new Opel Mokka. We are immensely proud of this car. I love this car. The Opel Mokka proportions are perfect, with short front and rear overhangs, a wide stance, and large wheels planted at the corners. You sit higher in the Mokka, but the car doesn't look high. We didn't want it to look like a little box. We wanted it to be sporty and dynamic. I've talked about the Manta's face and how it inspired the new face of all Opel cars you will see in the next few years. Here you see it in production reality for the first time, our new brand face, the Opel Visor. One single dark glaze module stretches across the full width of the fascia and integrates all the key visual elements. The new lighting systems, including the typical Opel wing-shaped daytime running lamps, and our new precisely crafted logo. The Opel Visor is progressive and very modern. It's also extremely confident without being aggressive. And it is visually perfectly organized, very clean and uncluttered. All attributes that are very German. The lighting systems use LEDs only. In the front and the rear, LEDs are standard. This allowed us to create very thin, extremely precise, powerful lighting units. As for the color execution, this version is the GS line with a particularly bold, sporty look. We've used a strong, contrasting black roof and hood to create a very sleek profile, emphasizing this further using the fresh red accent signature line to add even more energy to the design. And I think the black pack on the GS line version makes it even more dramatic. Open the door and you find red accents also in the interior of the GS line. This model has great ergonomic seats, of course, with sporty Alcantara or classic full leather. Your choice. And it even has driver massage available, too. But what you immediately see when entering the car is the new instrument panel layout. We call it the Opal Pure Panel, and it offers a completely new experience. There are no more analog instruments in the Opel Mokka. It's all digital. However, we have retained control buttons for essential functions in order to allow for intuitive usage and continuous focusing on the road. There are two screens of up to 10 and 12 inches, which deliver optimized information from the full maximized experience to the absolutely pure reduce mode when you decide that nothing should distract you while driving. From the beginning of our creative development, we spoke about creating visual and digital detox. We believe that we're bombarded with too much information in our daily lives and that providing a relaxed, focused experience is essential. So you'll find no fancy Hollywood-style animations in our instrument panel just the information you need when you need it. Bold and pure inside and out, this is how I would summarize the design work on the new Mocha and on all Opal models you will see going forward. Bold and pure as far as design is concerned. And if we talk engineering, the new Opal Mocha is both efficient and sophisticated. Hundreds of engineers have worked on the development of the new Mokka generation here in Rüsselsheim with the aim of making it agile and fun to drive on the one hand and of lowering its environmental footprint on the other hand. Among car manufacturers in Germany, Opel is the one that made the most dramatic improvements in reducing its average fleet CO2 emissions these last months. The reduction already reached 20% between the end of 2018 and the end of 2019. I repeat, 20%. We want to continue on this path, and the new Mokka has a technology that enables it. And most of all, it is electric.
This is our new fully electric Mokka, the Opel Mokka E, presented by Markus Lott, head of our research and development center here in Rüsselsheim. Thank you, Michael. The new Mokka is electric, but not only electric. It is based on Group PSA's multi-energy CMP platform, which has been developed to accommodate internal combustion powertrains as well as battery electric technology. Thanks to lightweight engineering, the new generation Mokka is up to 120 kilogram lighter than the previous one, while its body stiffness has been substantially improved. In addition, thanks to very precise development in aerodynamics, another Opel speciality, and thanks to cutting-edge engine technology, even the non-electric Mokka models have a minimal CO2 footprint. As for the electric version of the CMP platform, here it is. The battery that stores the energy in the car has been fully integrated into the platform. No space has been compromised for the driver or for the passenger. They have the same amount of room in a gasoline or an electric Mokka. The Mokka E has a lithium ion battery that stores 50 kilowatt hours of energy, allowing for a pure electric range of 324 kilometers according to the WLTP cycle. And you can even drive further than this if you take advantage of the energy recuperation system as easy as this. The electric motor in the Mokka E delivers 100 kilowatt, meaning 136 horsepower, and a maximum torque of 260 newton meters immediately available from the start. Select the sport driving mode, push the accelerator, and off it goes. 3.7 seconds from 0 to 50 kilometers per hour. The Mokka E is energetic and it's electric. The Mokka E is great fun with zero gram emission of CO2 local emission. For recharging the battery, many solutions are available. From single phase to three phase AC up to high power DC. AC, DC, the Mokka really rocks. Fast charging ability is a standard feature in the new Mokka. It can be plugged into a 100 kilowatt DC charger and its battery can go to 80% charge in just 30 minutes. As for those who prefer to remain loyal to more traditional powertrains, we offer two very lively petrol one diesel engine with 100 to 130 horsepower. The 130 horsepower petrol engine can be combined with a eight-speed automatic transmission including pedals at the steering wheel, enabling manual shifting and very active driving. Given the lightness of the car, these engines provide really great fun and are also extremely frugal. Combined consumption is between 3.8 and 4.8 liters per 100 kilometer in the NEDC cycle. In terms of CO2 emissions, we are talking of 100 to 111 gram per kilometer, and of course, zero gram for the electric version. A naive belief is that a platform is a given, a static entity which you have limited influence on. The truth is different. The CMP platform is a base our engineering team adapts and enriches to create our own vehicles with their own personalities and characteristics. We have been testing for months now. We have worked very hard on the CMP platform to create our Mokka. Especially the front axle has received a lot of our attention to combine perfect urban agility with safe high-speed driving on the German Autobahn. I'm eager to hear your comments once you drive the car yourselves. You will then also appreciate other highlights. The new Opel Mokka is packed with upper-class technologies. If you drive by night, you will be impressed by the IntelliLux LED matrix lighting system of the Opel Mokka. It allows you to permanently remain in high beam without glaring other users. No special action is required. It's all automatic. When you find yourself in a traffic jam, you will love the advanced cruise control with the stop and go function. It breaks the Mokka to a standstill and automatically follows the car ahead of you. 
automatically. Combined with the advanced lane positioning system, it lets you go through traffic jams in the coolest way ever. The infotainment system in the Mocha will entertain and network you and your passengers while driving. No distraction, they have integrated voice control. And of course, it's needless to say that they are Apple CarPlay and Android Auto compliant. Efficient and sophisticated. This is the technology we offer with our new Opel Mocha. Michael, I heard one of our friends was already able to experience the new Mocha. Is that right? Indeed, Markus. You drove it, I drove it as well, and I absolutely loved it. As did our dear Jürgen Klopp. Hello, everybody. Some months ago, my Opel friends brought a next-generation Mocha all the way from Rüsselsheim to Liverpool. It was a development car, so fully camouflaged with the big yellow K on its side. Really nice. I could take a very good look at it and was able to drive a little bit as well. That was very impressive. In the meantime, I've seen it fully fledged. No camouflage, no KM anymore. It's a pity, they could have kept that. It looked really cool in its camouflage color, but now, in reality, honestly, it's pretty amazing. Great new face, super design. And inside the cockpit, it's a lot of fun. Everything is digital and the display is as wide as a cinema screen. Awesome. And it gets even better because the Mocha goes as well as it looks. That's what cars should be like today. Spot on. Congrats to everyone in Rüsselsheim. You have definitely done a great job here. On par with the Champions League. Okay, that's enough praise. It's time for training now. And I obviously have to change. So, all the best from Liverpool and lots of fun with the new Mocha. Use your own club. Thanks a lot, Jürgen. Nobody can say it better than you. Now you wonder how much the new Opel Mocha costs. We open our order books today. So it is time to reveal our prices. Well, in Germany, at least. The Mocha price in Germany starts at 19,990 euros. And if you prefer to lease the Mocha, you can get it at an extremely affordable rate. The new Mocha is available in Germany from 129 euros a month with a deposit of less than 3,000 euros. Standard equipment in each and every Mocha comprises, among other things, the full LED lighting system in the front and in the rear, an electric park brake and traffic sign recognition. As for our Mocha E, the fully electric Mocha will be available from 32,990 euros in Germany. The price is then reduced by Umweltbonus. So you can drive an electric Mocha E for less than 24,000 euro here in Germany. You get what I believe is the sexiest car around and the full electric package for that price. No smaller battery, no reduced range, no reduced performance, but a charging cable is included. 100 kilowatt fast charging is on board. The full package. The new Mocha will hit the road early next year. It perfectly embodies the Opel brand values. Exciting, really exciting, approachable, and German in the most progressive way. The new Opel Mocha is fun, efficient, and innovative. Fit for urban mobility as well as for safe journeys on the Autobahn. The new Opel Mocha is the kind of car that puts a smile on your face. A car that makes your life colorful, energetic, and exciting. A car that makes your life less normal. Less normal, more Mocha. This is what we offer you with our new Opel Mocha. Thanks a lot. <laughs>